Hey guys, welcome back to a new video. So today we are going to make a Discord bot in Python. So uh, for this we are going to use the Discord file library. The Discord file library we are going to use for this. Okay, so let's begin. Okay, actually, yeah. So if you first you are going to it's okay. First, we'll see. We can before installing, we can we can read the documentation. I'll I'll keep this link below. Uh, Discord or five read the docs dot io and stable. Okay. So this is all the documentation for making a Discord bot in Python. So before that, we should go to his website called. Uh, let me go down the page. Yeah. Discord developer portal intro. So we have to go in this website first. This is a this has this is like for the it's a website for making a bot so it's a documentation click on that uh, yeah so i just scroll down uh, we, have to, we have to scroll down and have you see here yeah you have to go here bots and app you can see a bots and app and you see here so go and do it go go and make an app you click on this link and open a new tab and close this link yeah so this will show that I, the applications I have made it currently i don't have any application Okay, so let's create a new application. So let's actually name it Code Dog. Yeah, let's actually name it this Code Dog. Code Dog One Two Three Four Five. Yeah, you can keep any name for now. I'm creating Code Dog One Two Three Four Five. Okay, so yeah, create bot. It's gonna use the Discord file or API, which you're gonna use this here. So yeah. This is we can add a description and all. So before that we so we now we have to start coding. So before that we have to go to this uh, search pip install Discord. So when you go here on this website, you of course see uh, let me slow down. Yeah. So you're gonna see an app called Discord one point seven point three. Yeah. Do just click on copy this button. Then go to your uh, choice. Now then we're gonna go to terminal. Um, the terminal we have it so, yeah and you have to just paste it over here and just click enter and it shall install discord about uh, discord.py yeah i already installed it so you're gonna take so once you have installed the discord once you have installed it this is uh, this is gonna main field gonna be it's called okay like, your name you can add a description if you want you have to go in in directly bot i okay, let me scroll in so uh, you can see here the bot option. Yeah, we have to go in that. So let's click in that. Then it says, um, bring a bot to, uh, by bring a life by adding a bot user. It's actually true. So we got bot, uh, robots are too cool to destroy. Yeah, this is just a tagline by that. So, yeah, so we are going to create a bot now. Add a bot. So this is going to make the account if you make it a bot. So, yeah. So this is our bot now, and this is yeah okay. This is a bot now. We have all now. This is a bot, and this is the main one. Movie, okay. Now first, what are we gonna do? Wait, let let us go to Discord first of all. Wait, let me open Discord. Yeah, let me switch to my account. Okay, so. Let's create a yeah for now. Let's create a server. Um, let's create my own. Uh, uh, let me and my friends. Yeah, I have created a server. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So we have we have created a server and then now we have to add the bot to a server. Of course, that's the main thing. So we go a second. So yeah. So first we have to create a link to join it. Now, Discord by default does not give you a link, a uh, URL generator. So you have to search online Discord uh, so bot invite link generator. You have to make because you have to make it. That's one kind of, yeah. So I'll I'll, switch, I'll I'll keep this all links below so don't worry. So yeah. So I had to. So first we had to keep our client ID. Okay. So where we will find our client ID, go and send that information, application ID, okay not in this. Oh yeah, you see here client information, 
yeah this is your id of your client one mm, okay so let's you have to just copy this go here and i'll just paste it over here paste done now okay so by the bot now i want you have to give all you have to give permission so i will just give an administrator permission which will give it like all the power and also that's easier and now this is our link then okay let's just take this link now our link is generated now have to copy this link and just paste it on your browser and open it and that is now yeah it is an external application code that wants to just convert it now okay so okay so i'll take my server Mm, continue and it so it's gonna ask that i'm gonna take admin trader okay that's fine for me okay just add it in the notification and show you that that our, our bot has joined which means our bot is in this other server it's down there but the problem is you're seeing it offline right that's kind of problem because most bots are online you can't just you can't just do it right? you have to make it online so that's the way and the main thing comes in now we have to make that offline Online, I mean, sorry, yeah. Yeah, uh, so this is where we do that. Uh, our mission is our PyCharm or your weird code editor of stories. And just in first thing, as we have installed, so first we have to import this code. Import this code, this is the main one. Then we are okay, so before we are then we are import again from this is uh, this code dot. Uh, ext this is yeah ext import command so with this you are going to import all the commands into this code so the slash one so now you are going to create and um, we are going to create something called client or you can I mean, you may you can keep it bot client but for now I want to keep client client equals to command command dot bot okay hmm. And then we're gonna write command command prefix. Now this is where normally we write slash slash brand like that you can keep. So here is a you can write a slash dot. I'm gonna keep it slash because it's very popular. And now this is where we are we are ready. So we have done. So we have to create since we don't know when the board is gonna be ready, let's create like that. Then. Okay. So we are gonna create client dot event. When an event happens, it's created for an event. Okay. Okay. So client dot event async. We are gonna name async and def define it. We are gonna define it on ready. When it is ready, so it's gonna be like okay. So on ready. So just keep some brackets. Yeah. No, not these. <coughs> oh, sorry. Okay. So we are gonna write print. I'm gonna write bot is ready okay so which means that it will say our code yeah this means the bot is ready and it is now working okay so okay so now let's run it and let's see yeah wait before we run it we have to add a main yeah before we we had to add a main thing which is like one of the important thing is adding your token to token sorry sorry for it saying yeah i had to keep add your token which is like a password i told you before so we'll keep client dot run so it will tell it uh, the password now now it's like a password then you might be thinking then why am i sharing it i'm now after this way by the time don't try it also because by the time i upload this video i'm gonna reset it again so don't even try so you have to go here a bot and you have to click on reset token yes do it if you, I, yeah so you know you see here just copy it now don't try and mine that you can always gonna have to mine mine will be changed okay i just click on the copy go um, wait, go on there and go here now just paste it over here okay so this is your id and it will work let's run it main client is not defined Oh yeah, I got it because there's a capital C. Yeah, there's the only error I guess. Yeah, now it shall work, right? It will work fine. And okay, this is yeah, two lines is expected. So let's see. Um, client is not going to work. 
Oh yeah, oh I'm um, I'm going to get super capital C. Yeah. Line not run, okay? Now it's all work, is it? Where is Oh okay, sure. Okay, just wait, we have run. The bot is ready. So the bot should be online. Let's see. Now we can see the bot was is online now. Before it was it was uh, offline. Now it's online. Now if I ask it to say, um, it can't do anything right now. So the bot is like basically just online. It does not know what to do. So let's create some events and so it will get to know. So first let's yeah. So first let's create in uh, what should we create? Um, let's create a member join member leave one. Okay, that's just like a very common thing. Mm. A client non even with a capital C again after this. Yeah, a client even. Okay. Then I'm gonna add async. Okay, async dev uh, on member join. Join, okay. Join, uh, join, yep. So I'm gonna write this and member. We're gonna write here uh, member. Yeah, okay. Okay, so member, and we're gonna put here a colon, and we're gonna say print, and we're gonna make it a f string, f and print saying that. And then we're gonna create the this a calling member. So the person who left uh, join. We will get it on, it will get printed on our terminal. So, uh, has joined the server. Nice. Now, let's uh, just restart it. And, uh, okay, just give, it a just give it a second. Yeah, the bot is ready. Now, it should be online again. Let's just check it again. Perfect. It's, it's online. Now just let me uh, let me try to go through my alt account and just give me a second, okay? Okay, uh Okay, I just joined my alt account with this my alt account, okay? So it now it is saying this call will default to be showing but let's see your this terminal. Okay, it has not printed but usually it has to be. Um, it might be because of a normal issue, but okay. Generally, it should work. Actually, I don't know. Okay. So now let's create a command. Okay, I want to make some command getting kind of all of my events. Let's create a uh, create dot command. Um, command. Okay, and we're gonna say async dev. Um, we are going to write hello, if I say slash hello, it's going to say cpa, um, we are going to write await ctx dot send, we are going to write f string now, um, hello sir, so it's going to say that, it's going to say in discord chat now on the terminal, so let's restart it, um, restart and run, in a second, we can say the bot is online. Yeah, the bot is online. Wonderful. Now let's try it again. Now we go in this code. Now let's write, let's write this slash hello. Um, okay. Hello. Okay. And what's the problem? Excuse me. Let me just create another client. Okay, let's write, let me write here. Okay, let's write here. Oh, yeah, I get it now. That's the actual issue with this one. This one is not actually. This is fine, but this is a prefix that has a problem. Now, for some reason, this called that you should have something. I'm just going to give a dot for now. Okay. 
Um, just to be shouted up here. Oh my god. Okay. Okay, slowly we are. Now let's try it. Okay. Actually, dot hello. Let's just say dot hello. Okay. Okay, yeah. Yeah, let's 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 uh, hello. Um, why do I like it? Hello. Now this let's see. Hello, sir. See? So it's finally working. So whenever I write hello, sir, which hello, I'm I'm gonna say hello. Uh, hello. Hello, sir. Wonderful. Now it's working completely fine. Completely good. Completely fine. So let's like let's like go like a little complicated now, okay? Um let me guess. Let's um Let's make a kick command. So, okay. So let's make a kick command. That's gonna be a little hard, but let's try. Okay, client dot command. Okay. So client dot command async def kick. So it shall kick it, and it's gonna say ctx. That's for sending a message. Member. It's gonna be from which member is. It's gonna ask what type of number, so it's gonna I'm telling the Discord dot member, okay? Then I'm gonna keep a, a star again. I'm gonna write here. Then I'm gonna write reason man. If I have a reason, I'm gonna create for now. I don't want to make any reason. I'm just gonna write um, none. None, okay? Okay, wonderful. Now I'm gonna say this. So now let's give a a wait number dot kick. So it's gonna kick a number and reason equals reason. Since reason, okay. I like why do I create two brackets? I don't know. Okay. Reason is equal to reason. That means what is it's gonna ask the reason. I'm gonna tell you the reason. That is one done. Okay. Then let's write update um, CTX, which is gonna send a message. Then F a string. I'm gonna write K. K, and I'm gonna write. I'm gonna make them. I'm gonna make five type of mention. Number dot mention. Okay. So it can work now. Let's try. Um, it does not matter if this is expected to black line. It does not matter at all. Let's restart it and try again. Since I already added my alt account here, it's going to be even more easier to do this. So let's try again. Um, okay. Okay. The board is ready. It's online again. It was always, always online. Okay. Now let's do dot kick. Okay, dot kick, and I'm gonna make mention my alt. Yeah, my alt. Now I'm gonna let's see if it's gonna kick it or not. One, two, three, go. See, see, it just kicked my, it just kicked me out of the server. Wonderful. Now it's going to get it uh, out of the server. So that means it's gonna be, so it's always gonna kick someone. Which if I ask, so it's wonderful. It does. Let's do it for a bad command. Okay. So let me just add me again inside the server so that I can like what I mean so that I, I can show you the band command. Let me join again. Yep, I joined again. So now let's create a ba band command. Okay. So command command okay, let's make a work client dot kick. No, that's not quick. Sorry, command. I'm so, I'm so sorry. Yeah, and async dev. Then I'm gonna tell you ban this thing. Not like he, she's not join again anymore. So when you're gonna ban someone, then I have to write ctx. Um, ctx member in is Discord. Um. This call not member member okay then I'm gonna keep a star I will say the reason for ban it's same it's same like since I don't oh, 
since I don't have no reason for the ban, I'm just gonna keep none as I kept here. Okay, so reason is nothing but uh, none. Okay, mm, okay, done. Now I'm gonna make and so same as that a beat, uh, a beat member. It's gonna be it's it's same as uh, a person, so it's not that hard. I would say reason equals reason. Okay, done. Okay, now let's write a weight member. No, a weight member dot ban. Mm, wait, I would I want to send a message like CTX. I would say that send. This thing band. I'm gonna mention this number. Dot mention. Okay. Uh, mention. Okay. Okay. Uh, this is now done. Now let's see on it. Just on it. Now, so after this, uh, okay, done. Let's now just on this Discord. Yeah. Okay, so I rejoined myself back. Now next, I'm gonna ban myself. Okay, uh, ban. I'm gonna mention my name again. Wanna drama? And it shall ban me. Did it ban me? No, it did not. Oh, I got it. I just kept the wrong name. Okay, I had to write a capital B. And run the promo, okay. And the channel now kick uh, ban me out. Yeah, so it banned me now. For proof that I really it's got banned, I'm gonna show you. So, just give me a second. Yeah. So, really, I got banned. I can't show you. See this. So, this is a usually so I so I really got it banned. So, I can't rejoin the server. And I hope you all enjoyed this video. Using a uh, making a bot and Python and doing this all. So anyway, I hope you all enjoyed this video. Mm, don't forget to like and subscribe. In the next video, we'll probably work on unbanning from a Discord server. And I just I have to leave for it. That I did not done. Okay, I have to unbanning, muting someone, unmuting some a person. So we're gonna work on that in the next uh, video, I guess. Yeah. Okay. See you all in the next video. Then bye bye. It's not a game, it's a red stick.